dear students in this video i will simulate full wave rectifier using a pam circuit and i am simulating it using p space or cad or cad p space see in the full wave rectifier half wave rectifier portions will be there and then an op amp is added so i have simula already simulated a half wave rectifier session and so i am using the same circuit for constructing this full wave rectifier circuit so we need to include this resistors r3 r4 and this op amp okay let us uh, take that um, window see this is half wave rectified output we will obtain the half wave rectified output here so next we want to uh, input ua741 ua741 op amp so type it ua741 this is ua741 double click double click there and we can i can place it there and then escape next i want see next i want uh, one resistor uh, how many resistors uh, two resistors so type r from the keyboard double click on this r analog so i want two resistors one at the here and other at this point okay next i uh, escape i want two voltage sources so type vdc vdc so uh, double click here vdc one voltage source is at the seventh uh, seventh pin and other at this point okay and then, then escape then i want uh, ground connection so ground is here and select zero cap sim uh, and one ground at this for this voltage source and other for this voltage source then escape now i can uh, uh, wire wire it so uh, place wire click place wire and from this node to this node drag wire then from this node mm, to this node drag wire and from this resistor to sixth uh, sixth pin i can let us see let i can i have to stop otherwise it will cross like this i can connect to the wire uh, let me stop here and wire and again i can draw the wire connection to this point okay so now then escape if the wire coming like this you have to press escape okay one second uh, i can delete this wire uh, there was some error the system is busy one second again i can make a connection mm, uh, see uh, here i want to connect uh, this output uh, to second pin place wire uh, from this second pin i have to connect uh, to in between the middle of this resistor escape uh, if then i can uh, connect to this third pin to this sorry uh, let me delete that wire delete one second that is first escape and then delete that wire uh, then uh, place wire and from the third pin i have to draw the connection to you can draw the connection like this see even though it is overlapping uh, there is no um, external connection for that wire because uh, we are not making any junction or node uh, there okay so and again place wire from this node to this node okay so this is then press escape okay so now the connection is okay next i have to connect uh, this voltage sources before that uh, escape before that i have to rotate this voltage sources click r from this keyboard no. rotate so that we can connect the plus terminal to 7 here also rotate by clicking r from this keyboard then we have to uh, make wire see from this point to this point and from mm, this point to this point then from uh, this point to this ground again from this point to this ground now almost all the connections are finished next we have to type the values see this is 1k this all are correct values and this resistance is 1k this also 1k and this voltage source value is 15 dc that is 15 we can type 15 and click ok next this also 15 volt uh, let us select this page one mm, uh, let's just uh, click on the zero vdc so click there and 15 we can select ok next uh, we can go to p spice uh, new simulation profile we can type there full wave that is full wave full there will no need to uh, type a space full wave Praveena I am typing my, my name also 
mm, okay create and uh, next we have to uh, be here simulations uh, settings will be appearing here we have to type the uh, anal we have to select analysis time domain transient here run to time is i am selecting 5 millisecond mm, and uh, see what uh, here i am starting from 0 millisecond and step size i am giving it as 5 microsecond 5 view then apply or okay uh, directly you can click okay Next, I have to place the node output voltage node. I am taking the output from this here. Just uh, I am taking the output, then escape. And uh, next, we have to run the simulation. Run it, and the uh, output waveform will be appearing. Mm, see here, it is uh, there. Uh, let us see. But uh, some error is uh, shown here. That is less than two connections at a node. Uh, at a node N double zero seven. Let us see that. Let us rectify that error. Wait. for that actually the error was at this point see you can see here the node is not connected here so let us uh, that means this point is not connecting together so let us connect it together so just to delete this wire and draw a uh, wire here place uh, from this point to this point you have to end this wire here I am ending this wire and you, we have to keep a node here then we can place voltage node at this point then only output waveform will be appearing here escape then we can run this simulation so now a full wave rectified output will be appearing you can simply see the comment box then you can um, uh, you can uh, find where the error is occurring um, there and here the error was less than two connections uh, that means that circuit section uh, does not have a node at this place we can simply name this by place clicking see here place net alias uh, we can type it as full wave full wave full wave okay and uh, you can uh, put it here uh, and then escape so you can see uh, then run this simulation you will get the output waveform wait session log there is an error wait uh, there is uh, some error in um, uh, typing the name that is full wave there is we have to keep it there One second. We cannot uh, name like that. That is see. Just delete that name. See if you want to. Just delete that wire, and you you can place place Natalia's. You can name V O okay you can click it there and then escape then run simulation you will get the output waveform like this so and its name is vo okay that's all uh, about this full wave rectifier output and if you want to see the half wave rectified output you can uh, simply place the node at this point you see uh, this is your circuit diagram you can simply place a node see voltage node this is voltage node you can place it there and again you can place it there this is v negative half and then escape you can name it also this is negative half this is positive half positive half you can name it as v positive half so okay and click at this point click at this wire okay and then escape and now you can run the simulation you will get a different uh, this is half wave rectified output this is full wave rectified output like that you will get different waveforms you can separate each one uh, you can uh, subplot it that is plot add plot to window click here mm, and uh, trace add trace v of v out one wave you can see wait v of v negative half will be appearing at this okay one second there is some error in this negative half let us see again you can delete this F. and again you can float add float 